we have another pop star match report for you now. Craig out of the fall, been to see Manchester City. How was it? Uh, grim. Grim, really. Well, I, I, once again, you see, because people always assume that I've got loads of technology available to me here and lots of people rushing about giving me bits of paper like they do on television. In fact, I'm just watching the television, so uh, the city score passed me by, I'm afraid. So uh, It was nil-nil. Kind of, we, uh, who, who are you playing? I don't even know. West Ham. Oh, right, yeah. OK, go on, tell us all about it. Then. Well, uh, I mean, uh, the first half, we're all over them. It's a typical City game, you know. We, like, kind of uh, totally outplayed them. And the rubbish, anyway, yes, West Ham, it's got to be said. But... Uh, There's going to be a lot of people driving south they are going to turn their cars around and go back up towards Manchester. Yeah, today. good. Uh, I hope Adrian <laughs> Sherwood's listening. <laughs> <laughs> but... Um, no, we're all over in, in the first half, and I don't know what he puts in the tea in the second half, Brian Orton, but um, they were like kind of zombies when they came back on. There, were, there weren't any good player apart from a uh, Roll Castle, which I thought was a... He was dazzling on that uh, match on television. It, it was, it well, was it's just that one little thing where he, he sort of... Uh, he he just, just, like, rolled the ball under his foot. That's he, right, and, like, got away from to, three uh, defenders. Yeah, brilliant, but... Um, uh, a good bye, then. He was. Well, we swapped him for uh, David White to lead. They got the real uh, rough end of the stick there, which is good. But um, as I say, we just kind of... We'll, we play really nice football at the moment because now Quinn's not there. We used to like kind of just boot the ball to Quinn and he'd head it to uh, the opposing side's defender. <laughs> now you have to do something else with it. Well, it? yeah, and we do. We play lots of football, loads of passing. We're playing too much football. I mean, they just kind of... Uh, Everyone's, like, looking for a passing opportunity rather than, like, a scoring opportunity. Not going to go down, though, are they, Craig? Uh, I don't know. I mean, every, everyone, else in the, everyone else in the band thinks they're going to go down, but they've just, like, suddenly come out of the closets, you know, they've, like, discovered the grandfather was a United fan right. from years back. Oh, it's like the whole of Man Manchester at the moment, anyway. What, they're all United fans? Yeah, you suddenly see all the United uh, shirts on and... Uh, I was told, you see, I was always told uh, the, the conventional wisdom was that uh, United supporters were people who, who didn't live in Manchester, you know, they all came from around yeah, about, and yeah, uh, the yeah. cities of everybody in Manchester actually supported City, but this isn't the case anymore. Well, the true Mancunian is the Man City fan, I find, yeah. <laughs> I mean, they're, they're all Cockney Reds, really, aren't they? And, uh, <clears throat> as so, I say, uh, the bass player and the drummer, they've suddenly uh, discovered the United fans. And, oh, that's, that's shocking, that, isn't <laughs> it? How can people do that? I mean, I just can't imagine changing your allegiance like that. Well, no, it's a sign, well, it's a sign of a... So it's well, following Sissy, you've got to be some kind of a masochist because it can be brilliant one week. I mean, the Ipswich thing when Franny Lee came was really good. Yeah. yeah. It, it came last week. What did you think of Ipswich, by the way? Because I see them fairly regularly. Uh, fairly good, uh Fairly good football, you know, yeah. nice passes and everything. You don't and score they, against they, them. They're quite like City in that they can't finish off. You know? Yeah, that's right. You don't score against them. Another goalless draw they were involved in, in uh, today. Yeah. You got any fall stories for us, Craig? Before we go? Uh, not really. We ju we're just finishing an LP now. Um, and then uh, there's like kind of tentative thing. We might be going to Russia. Well, right. Doing a tour and that, but. OK, well, listen, thanks very much. All right, John. And uh, if you feel like doing this again, please do. You know, always nice to hear from, uh, well, anybody from the fall, of course, there was uh, a particular frisson on uh, this programme. i get the BBC to get me a season ticket, though. All right, I'll see what I can do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks, John.